Hello everyone and welcome back to All Indie. Today we are playing a game called Cesspool. Um, this game, um, as you can tell, created, I think, quite literally by one person, at least uh, developed by one person, and I was done by, in his spare time. Um, and he's taking a little... He's basic. How I understand it is he's taken, like, aspects of Pokemon and kind of merged them with his own sort of sci-fi wastelander JRPG, which to me seems really cool. Um, so I wanted to give a shout out to at Eric, Eric Leo Colette. Um, he was the one that reached out to me on Twitter and he was like, Hey, thanks for the follow. Um, he was like, it's not necessary. Uh, this was the tweet. He said, Hey, thanks for the follow. It's not necessary. But while I have your attention for a moment, could you tweet support for cesspools Kickstarter? Um, indie RPG, one person developing the game. It's like, I really want to see this game come to light. Um, and he said, thanks for your time. Have a good one. I was like, done. I backed it. And, um, you know, I was like, do they have a demo? Um, and I honestly, I thought he was the dev, but he was, he was like, no, it's developed by this person. I was like, oh, okay. And I had to read, do my tweet. Um, and so, yeah, they reached out and they were like, yeah, if you want, why don't you go ahead and give the demo a try? Yes. Sure. Uh, and apparently I, I was told to say that it is a very, very early beta. Very early beta. Um, but I thought it looked cool. Ooh. From the outset, a wanderer walks the earth with her best friend, the monkey Pluto. She survives in this ruined world thanks to her rifle and her versatile skills. Luna, done. Is it Luna? Yeah. Ah, Pluton, look at that face. <laughs> We're not far now, Luna. Look over there, up north. Oh man, this gives me... Yeah, very old school JRPG vibes. Like, uh... Some of the old school Final Fantasies. It was a Chrono Trigger. Oh. Oh, the nostalgia is strong with this one. Do you see the mountains? That's the Lunar Spur. Once we have passed it, we will come across the cesspool, all right, Luna? Let's go! I like your enthusiasm. Yeah, let's go. Hello? What are you waiting on? Wait for me, Pluton. Over there, Luna. We only have those ruins to cross. And go ahead. Run off. Oh, This does give me very Pokemon vibes. But yeah, I mean, very Game Boy Color era JRPG. Luton, don't run that fast! One says there are human beings at the cesspool. I'm filled with eagerness. Alright, Pluton. Take it easy, my dude. Alright, Pluton, I understand, but watch yourself, okay? Don't worry about me, Luna. Runs off. This'll be my villain arc. He's gonna run off and, like, die or something, and I'm, I'm gonna be like, I will destroy this world. Oh, I love it. Oh, even the music. I'm like, uh, 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 uh. Bhutan? Buddy? See? I told you, this is my villain arc right here. You made it this far. Surely you won't stop now. Take a step further. Who was that, Bhutan? Jesus, is that you? Satan? Uh oh, why'd you kill the music? Uh. Okay. Heavy door blocks the passage to the cesspool. The door creaks and opens slowly. But wait, uh, wait a minute. Pluton. My man. Is Pluton in my imagination? Is he an alter ego? Pluton. My, my boy. What? Okay, alright, fine. I guess I'll go on without him. I'm not crying, you're crying. Uh... 
world as we know it has collapsed. Ah. I'm so confused. Is this a button? All right, and we're back. All right, so I didn't want the whole video to be like cropped off like that, so I had to like go back, restart. I also was a little stuck on those spikes, and I was like, there's no way I, I couldn't figure out how to get past in. It turns out that you can sprint, so I had to go around and mess with the settings. Uh, all right, heading into the cave. What? Oh, come on. There we go. Lunar Spur. What does this say? Okay, we're back. All right, feeling it. There we go. Relax a little. The world as we know it has collapsed. Monsters were devouring us one by one. Some gone crazy. We're killing each other. Hmm. All right. It was then that an immaculate artifact tore the skies apart and crashed into the earth. Okay. There, there arose. There arose six knights who annihilated the monsters. All right, cool. Six knights, I like it. Destiny seems to be calling me. I love it. Okay, with the help of their gods, they erect cities to shelter us. We were safe and sound. Were we? I saw what was outside. Is it the cesspool that was safe? I'm a little confused. Proton. Uh, my boy. Oh, alright. Can't swim. Afraid of water. Classic. Lunar Spur, the ultimate rampart of the cesspool. Ooh. Oh. Beautiful. Look at them pixels. Look at it. My, my god. The ground is cracked. Do you feel the vibration? Can I not walk over it? I can't. Okay. Maybe I need a shovel or something. Maybe a, a dig, a TM. You know what I mean? Gosh, I'm so mad. Are you my rival? <laughs> oh, Snoot. Snoot? Oh, Snoot, a human. I beg your pardon? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Mind your damn business. What do you mean? You really are a human being. I can't wait to tell Pluton. He's my best friend. I lost sight of him just before crossing these mountains. You crossed the Lunar Spur? Impossible. Are you a... Um, uh, yeah, I didn't catch that word. Ah, damn. It's the truth. I've spent my life traveling. Those mountains were no trouble. Liar! The heroes built this wall with the help of the gods in order to protect us. Sure. It is my duty to arrest you. <gasps> Ooh. Attack? Okay. Ooh. Uh, um. Ooh. Comrades? How about defense? If he's gonna attack. Solid. Are you just gonna keep attacking? Lecture? Lecture? I think the person who made this is French. Ooh! Little quick draw? I like it. Oh. Uh-oh. Yep. We're just gonna do it again. Pow, pow, pow! Ooh, 20 damage. Okay, I gotta know. Ugh! There we go. Yep. Put it down. My man, man, you hit hard. Fanatic. Do I have any items? I do not. Um. Run away. Heck no. Thirty salt crystals and pure water. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I'm so sorry. Are you alright? No, you shot him like six times. 
Thank you, somebody with some sense. What does it look like? You shot my guts with lead. I just wanted to get some pure water. How will I go on with my quest now? I have to get back before nightfall. Let's say I give you a hand. Would you help me find Pluton? What could a brat possibly provide me? All right, bro. Take, you know, just like tone down the attitude a little bit and maybe you'll get yourself some water, okay? Well, I could leave you for dead. Yeah, sucker, shoot your guts up with lead again. Indeed, in that case, I accept. I have to go east to the rubble to defeat the tyrannical jailer. I like it, all right. Oh, but what is your name? Determined and vindictive this zealot. Is that, I wonder if that's supposed to be zealot and it's in French. Either way, Zelot does not give up n never to do his duty. His great health and techniques allow him to protect his comrades. Ooh, I like it. Arthur. <laughs> All right, done. I am Arthur. I like it. Nice to meet you. I'm Luna. Right. There is the scavenger stop. Let's take a little break, okay? Arthur and Luna form a pair. I like it. Oh, it's literally just like right here. All right, dope. Source of Psyche are present all over the cloak. They save your progression and regenerate the health of the psych. Psyche of comrades. Will is seeping from the earth to you. You are rest. Your progress is saved. Yo, dog. <laughs> Lol. That's okay. That's pretty funny. I actually appreciate the fact that that's just like your, uh, what you left it with. <laughs> By defeating monsters, I've hoarded a lot of salt crystals. I trade them for roots to recover some health when needed. But I could also gather a little more and buy a bracelet to protect myself. You're a weird dude, yellow guy. Simon, Psyche has leaked from the bowels of the earth since the fall of the artifact. It is quite invigorating. Take this opportunity for a break, okay? <laughs> music. I gotta give props to the guy who did the music, because I think he really captured, like, the old-school RPG vibes. Um... A song. I don't think I'm gonna sell you my pure water, so can we just... Let's just get out of here. Stop right now, kids. I cannot let you walk the Exodus Canyon Pass like this. The little girl does not know any skills. You are not prepared. A comrade gathers gray matter by annihilating monsters. Accumulating enough will grant him a neuron. Neuron? Okay. They allow him to improve a character or learn a psychic skill. Luna currently has a neuron. She can learn three and one. Cool. Treasure. Treasure fishing can hurt a monster while drawing out some salt. Cesspool's currency. Ooh. Conchillion Trap will damage and disrupt a monster using a melee attack. Ooh, Oceanic Flow allows a comrade to act two times each turn. Ooh. All right. To acquire skills, select a comrade in the menu and open his cortex. There we go. Comrades, this guy. Beach Towel. Cracked Bat. I love it. Um. Oh, no, I wanted that. Hang on. Traveler's Cortex? Ooh! Ooh, what a nice, what a cool skill tree. Let's come right two times. That's pretty cool. Place a trap at the feet of your, of a comrade who neutralizes and hurts the monsters. Ooh! Hurt a monster and draw out some salt. I think we'll just go with salt. Yeah. Treasure fishing. Oh, dexterity plus one. Ooh, yeah. Oh, this is cool. Um, so let's see. Okay, so we're good to travel. We're good to go. Yeah, that's what I thought. What? Who are you? A monster. Watch out. If we approach it, a brawl will be inevitable. It doesn't scare me. We will not progress. We will not progress if we are not facing adversity. Very good. Attack him with all your might. I've got your back. Yeah. Through the power of friendship. Yeah. 
cast. Um. Yeah, give me your soul. Uh, oh, okay. I love the animations. Yeah, again, this is very... Oh. Takes me back. Takes me back. I love it. Finished, are you okay? Don't worry, I'll always survive against these monsters. Your talents will be very useful in front of the jailer. The rubble is in the east. Let's go! Uh, okay. So I'm heading east. Monster? Okay. I gotta say. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and end... Uh, end the, uh, the video here. I have to say, this is... This is, like, beautiful. This is awesome what you've been able to create just in your spare time. Um, yeah. And I mean, like you told me, it's beta. It's a, it's a beta version. So... I think it just needs polish, to be completely honest with you. Like, I think you've got all the main mechanics down, right? You've got the, like, you know, the text needs a little bit of editing, and, like, you've got to put up portraits for, you know, the guys back here at the shops. But, like, your map, maps, super cool. Movement, um, attacking, and the menus for, like, you know, your psyche or your magic, attacking looks really cool like a lot of those animations are super awesome so i'm gonna leave a i'm gonna leave a a, a link to the kickstarter and the itch.io in the description below go check it out if you're a fan of these kinds of games i think you'll be very surprised with with cesspool to be honest so go check it out this has been really cool thank you for sharing this with me i'll also i think i'll leave his twitter down below as well so go check him out this was this was awesome. Thank you for sharing. Oh, I love it. Oh, even the music. I'm like, uh, 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 uh. Bhutan? Buddy? See? I told you. This is my villain arc right here.